attachments and relations of the typical thoracic vertebra. On the anterior side of the body, this is the anterior side of the body. The upper borders, this is the upper border and the lower border. These borders, they provide attachment to the anterior longitudinal ligament. The anterior longitudinal ligament, it is attached to the upper and lower borders of the anterior surface of the body. Similarly, on the posterior surface of the body, the upper borders and the lower borders, they provide attachment to the posterior longitudinal ligament. The upper border of the lamina and the inferior parts or the lower parts of the lamina, they all together they provide attachment to ligamentum flava. The transverse processes, these are the transverse processes of the typical thoracic vertebra. This is the posterior surface of the transverse process. There is this is the anterior surface of the transverse process. The tip of the transverse, the tip of the transverse process, it provides attachment to the lateral coastal transverse ligament. The lateral coastal transverse ligament, it is attached to the tip of the transverse process. The lower border of the transverse process, this is the lower border of the transverse process. This is the lower border. The lower border it provides attachment to the superior coastal transverse ligament. The superior coastal transverse ligament attaches to the lower border of the transverse process. On the anterior surface, this is the anterior surface of the transverse process and it provides attachment to the inferior coastal transverse ligament. The inferior coastal transverse ligament it is attached to the anterior surface of the transverse process. The intertransverse ligaments and muscles they are attached to the upper border and the lower border of the vertebra. The muscle levator costae is attached on the posterior surface of the transverse process. This is the posterior surface of the transverse process and provides attachment to levator costae. The facets, these are the facets that are, that are present on the anterior surface of the transverse process of a typical thoracic vertebra and they provide attachment to the tubercle of its own rib. The tubercle of its own rib is attached to the facet present in the transverse process. These are the superior coastal demifacet and the inferior coastal demifacet that are present on each side. Similarly here, the superior coastal demifacet as well as the inferior coastal demifacet. The superior coastal demifacet it attaches to the head of its own rib whereas the inferior coastal demifacet it articulates with the head of the rib below. So there is a partial articulation with the superior coastal demifacets and the inferior coastal demifacets. Thank you.